Hello and welcome to this build video for the Moo Multiple. There is already a build video for this out there, but I've upgraded the kit or added an option to uh, get real King Poo or Thonky Kong Jacks, the real deal, uh, with hex nuts instead of the um, where you have three pins like this instead of these uh, a bit just a fraction bit cheaper jacks uh, with solder lugs and a knurled nut uh, that you slotted in here. So I just want to make uh, the video for this kit with the uh, Donkey Kong jacks instead or King Koo jacks as their, their real name and but the the name that everyone uses it is Donkey Kong so uh, it's much easier of course but there is one single caveat that you need to know and that is that just as with the other uh, jacks the ground lug of two of these share space so uh, there 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 and there all those eight on this side in pairs of two they share ground lug and that is so we can fit one more um, jack in this so we have eight on this side and four on that side so it should look like that that's the you do something similar with these jacks uh, but this is much easier uh, just as long as you make sure that they stay in place so I suggest adding these on this side first because those ground pins is the only thing that could possibly be a bit of a nuisance uh, but as you can see it's not super difficult to put them in place and these on this side they just go in as they should and because the 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 holes are so big because they should fit for these solder lugs as well. Uh, they do move around a bit like so. So before soldering them in place you really need to put this on and make sure that they are all aligned. Uh, and I would suggest at least adding one up here, one nut up here. And because it's hex nuts, we can use a tool like this to get them nice and tightly fit. And one down here, I would suggest. Perhaps one in the middle as well. Uh, I'll leave that decision up to you. So now we can turn this over, making sure that they're all flush. And then we just solder this together and nuts on and we should have a new nice multiple, passive multiple. Oh, let's turn on the fan for this. We have to take care of our lungs in this hobby.
and those dual logs um, is yeah, they're quite easy to solder together too. Not does not pr propose a difficulty, I think. Last one, and there. And then just adding the jacks. No, adding the the nuts. And we are good to go. And of course this one has to make a fuss. And there we have it. So this is the multiple move multiple with Donkey Kong jacks and hex nuts uh, for a bit of a different look and probably a lot better uh, quality in the switching. Could also probably there's a few. These are a bit easier to chop off then the lugs from the other uh, on the other jacks so I'll actually say this is worth doing except for the mess that I'm making because they're flying all over the place Right then, so the Mo multiple with Donkey Kong jacks uh, if you want uh, better jacks for your multiple. So thanks for watching, take care, bye.